Any other great experiences or things you'd like to tell? Oh about man, about I have outreach? so many experiences with uh, with vegan outreach. Actually, this this week uh, I just wrote a really long post about this to our Adopt a College um, server about this. I've been tr getting more people involved helping me while I'm at colleges who are not vegetarian. Oh, now that's impressive. So they'll come up to me and they'll be like, "Wow, this is crazy. This is so scary. People need to know about this." Or it's like, "What can we do? How can we?" Blah, 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 and I just have a really quick conversation. I'll be like, I bet you have five minutes. Give them a small stack. Why don't you help me hand some out? And they're like, oh, wow, okay. Uh, and they didn't turn me down. So I had three people in three days do this with me. Nice. And it was great. Be uh, great for a couple of reasons. One, um, even though they're not vegetarian or vegan, they are now an animal rights activist, whether they like it or not. Mm -hmm. They have just created a new part of their identity, and it's really empowering. They're going to go tell their friends and their family, and it's going to stick with them. And what I, what I saw on all these people after they, after they worked with me um, was that they had like a new conviction and understanding of the issue. It was like a deeper rapport that had, that had developed. And I think the chances of them going vegetarian or vegan is so much greater because of that. And it's, it's a win-win because more pamphlets were handed to students. So more, more of them got out. That's, I mean, by, by the way, that's, I don't think I mentioned that. That's the majority of my job is just going to schools and handing out flyers, or booklets, I'm sorry, uh, flyers a little thing. Uh, we have, our booklets are 16 pages long, and they have all kinds of information about animals and what's going on, and then in the back we have nutrition information and recipes and stuff like that. We have a separate booklet that has lots of nutrition information, I don't have one of those today, but. Okay. So yeah. I find that nutrition is one of the biggest issues for vegans because mm -hmm. you can be a carbitarian you know you can live off chocolate and french fries mm -hmm. totally guilty of doing it from time to time <laughs> uh, -huh. uh and cereal and be like man what's the last time i had a vegetable i had kale nutritional yeast and quinoa last night that sounds awesome oh great it is awesome well if if you're interested about vegan nutrition um, i'm halfway through it right now Jack Norris, the president and co-founder of Vegan Outreach, just came out with a book called Vegan for Life. And it's awesome. And it covers everything about vegan nutrition from A to Z. Nice. So if you have any, any people watching have any questions about that, just uh, go on Amazon and check out Vegan for Life by Jack Norris. Awesome. Um, I have a few sites to promote. We have veganoutreach.com. We have... Org. Org. Okay. I think it'll still show up. Though. It'll still show up. Yeah. Um, we have 17thandhoff.org. We have vegankitchen.tv. Um, let's see. Am I missing anything? Oh, what's the Twitters for you if you'd like? I'm Vegan Brian on Twitter. It's pretty easy. My name is spelled with an I. B-R-I-A-N. And then vegan at Vegan Outreach. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. And then at Vegan Kitchen TV and at 17th and Hoff. And I'll give a little shout to my friend Michelle, who has a very popular Twitter as well, sure uh, Vegan Break. So I, check that out. And what does Vegan Break talk about? What does Michelle? She talk does about? Um, some videos. Uh, like she went to s some local vegan restaurants and just, you know, had some of the food and talked about that. She cooked something with her her mom, who's also vegan. Um, she is just like really up to date on all her tweets. So it's like, if I want current vegan information of any kind, I go to her Twitter. That's Because awesome. she just reviews so many of people's other Twitters and just compiles the best of the best. That's awesome. And what is it again? Vegan Break. Vegan Break. Mm -hmm. I've seen Vegan Break. I follow Vegan Break. She should be on here someday. She should. Yeah. And then uh, she can be on, you can be on hers. That would be awesome. It would be a big party. It would be. Vegan party! That's right. All right, guys. So um, is there anything else you would like to add to the show? Um, well, I mean, if... Anybody is interested in getting involved in vegan outreach, go to adoptacollege.org, A-D-O-P-T-A-C-O-L-L-E-G-E.org. It has all the information that you need to know about getting involved with uh, college leafleting. And um, you know, if you guys missed the show today, then all this information will also be on the blog when we post it up. So um, thank you for tuning in. and. Uh, have a great day. Thank you, Brian, for coming on the show. Glad to be on here. Okay. Yeah. Bye. Bye-bye.